the moon, our constant companion in the night sky. For centuries, it has captivated humanity, inspiring myths, legends, and scientific inquiry. We've gazed up at its cratered surface, wondering about its secrets. One secret has always intrigued us. Does water exist on the moon? For a long time, we believed the moon was a dry, barren world. Images from telescopes and early missions seem to confirm this. But recent discoveries have overturned this assumption, revealing a fascinating truth. The moon, it turns out, holds water. This discovery has profound implications for the future of space exploration. This is the story of how we found water on the moon and what it means for our future among the stars. It's a story of scientific endeavor, technological ingenuity, and the boundless human thirst for knowledge and exploration. The quest to find water on the moon has been a long and winding road. Early telescopic observations offered hints of water ice in permanently shadowed craters at the lunar poles. These craters, shrouded in perpetual darkness, held the potential for preserving volatile compounds like water ice. Then came the Apollo missions. While they didn't find liquid water, they brought back lunar samples that hinted at the presence of water molecules trapped within the lunar soil. These findings, while intriguing, were not conclusive. The debate about water on the moon continued. However, the possibility of lunar water was too tantalizing to ignore. New missions were planned, armed with advanced technology and a renewed determination to unlock the moon's secrets. The search for Lunar H2O was far from over. The turning point came in the 21st century with a series of groundbreaking missions. In 2008, India's Chandrayaan-1 mission detected evidence of water molecules on the lunar surface. This was a major breakthrough, confirming what previous missions had only hinted at. NASA's Lunar Crater Observation and Sensing Satellite, or LCROSS, provided further confirmation in 2009. The mission intentionally crashed a rocket stage into a permanently shadowed crater near the lunar south pole. The impact ejected a plume of material which was analysed and found to contain significant amounts of water ice. These discoveries sent shockwaves through the scientific community. The moon, once thought to be bone dry, was revealed to harbour vast reserves of water ice, particularly in the permanently shadowed craters at its poles. This wasn't just a scientific curiosity, it was a game changer. The discovery of water on the moon is significant for several reasons. First, it changes our understanding of the moon's formation and evolution. The presence of water tells us a lot about the early solar system and the processes that led to the moon's formation. Second, water is a vital resource for human exploration. It's essential for life support, of course, but it can also be broken down into its components, hydrogen and oxygen. These elements can be used as rocket propellant, making the moon a potential refueling station for missions to Mars and beyond. Third, the discovery of water on the moon opens up exciting possibilities for lunar settlements. With a readily available source of water, we can start thinking about establishing a permanent human presence on the moon, a lunar base from which to explore the solar system. Section 5 Lunar Oasis – Water's Impact on Future Missions The presence of water on the moon has profound implications for future lunar missions. It simplifies mission planning and reduces costs. Instead of hauling water from Earth, which is incredibly expensive, we can potentially extract it from the moon. This opens up a world of possibilities. We can envision lunar outposts with greenhouses using lunar water to grow food. We can imagine lunar rovers powered by fuel cells utilizing hydrogen extracted from water ice. The discovery of water transforms the moon from a barren outpost into a valuable resource hub, a stepping stone to the stars. It's no longer a question of if we can establish a permanent human presence on the moon, but when... Section 6. Fueling the future water as a resource. The potential uses of lunar water go beyond just sustaining life and agriculture. Water's true value lies in its potential as a fuel source. By splitting water molecules into their constituent hydrogen and oxygen atoms, we can create a potent rocket propellant. This process, known as electrolysis, could turn the moon into a cosmic gas station. Spacecraft could refuel on the lunar surface, drastically reducing the cost of deep space missions. 
Imagine launching missions to Mars or the asteroid belt from the moon, utilizing lunar-derived fuel. This possibility transforms our entire approach to space exploration. It makes ambitious missions more feasible and opens up new frontiers for discovery. Section 7, Moon Village, a stepping stone to the stars. The discovery of water on the moon paves the way for a permanent human presence beyond Earth. We can now envision a future where a lunar village, a bustling hub of scientific research and exploration, thrives on the lunar surface. This village could house scientists, engineers, and even tourists, all contributing to a new era of lunar exploration. It could serve as a testbed for technologies and strategies for living and working on other celestial bodies, paving the way for missions to Mars and beyond. The moon, once a symbol of distant beauty, is now within our grasp. It's no longer a destination, but a stepping stone, a launch pad to the cosmos. Section 8, The Final Frontier, A Universe of Possibilities. The discovery of water on the moon is a testament to the power of human curiosity and ingenuity. It underscores the fact that the universe is full of surprises waiting to be uncovered. It reminds us that the more we explore, the more we realize how much more there is to learn. As we venture further into space, the moon with its newfound bounty of water will play a pivotal role. It will be our stepping stone, our testing ground and our resource base as we reach for the stars. The future of space exploration is bright and water, the elixir of life, will light our way. The final frontier awaits and with the moon as our guide, we are ready to explore its boundless possibilities.